The Simons dominating at 289. The Perez's have got to hurry up. Josh and George. Oh boy, I'll triple the points, okay? A triple market. I'm only going to read this question once, though, okay? Ginger, David, reading it once, so everybody pay attention. Top four answers on the board. Name a bad place to burst out laughing. Funeral. At a funeral. Can you believe it? There's one answer better than that. Mm, church? Church. OK, they're going to play. OK. Let's go, David. Let's go. A wedding. At a wedding. Yes. yes. A wedding. Okay. It's all right, it's just one strike. Go, join. Come on, join us. How about in court? <laughs> yes. <laughs> court. <laughs> Simon's two strikes, get ready to steal. Come on, Come on, Come on How about all right, Aurelia. The theater. In the theater. Yes. yes. If it's up there, you guys are still alive. If not, the Simons get a chance to steal for the game. Theater. There you go. Henry, there's one more up there. You have two strikes. This is pair play right now. Three seconds. All right, Henry, it's okay. The Simons get a chance to steal. What are we hearing? In the classroom. In the classroom. 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 Hospital. We got a hospital. hospital. We've got classroom. classroom. Again, you have a choice to make. I'm going to say a classroom. In the classroom. OK. Good answer. It's up there. You've stolen the points, the game, for the fifth and final time. Classroom. <laughs> All right, what is number four? Library. Library. Nobody's at 300 points, so we're playing sudden death tiebreaker. Ginger, David. Okay, good luck, you guys. For this survey, we're only asking for the top answer. I've tripled, I've quadrupled, I've, I've like made all the points in the world. You will win the game if you get this answer. Name something specific a guy might smell before he puts it on. Cologne. David. Cologne. One and it's time to play fast money and a shot at twenty thousand dollars. <laughs> David is off stage. We can't see or hear your answers. I'll ask you five questions in twenty seconds. Give me the most popular answer. Okay. If you can't think of something, say pass, and we'll come back to it if there's time left. Now, if you and David together get two hundred points, you'll win twenty thousand yeah. dollars. Are you ready? Yes. Twenty seconds on the clock, please. <laughs> clock will start after I read the first question. Name a sport that requires a lot of running. Football. Name something that can be cherry flavored. Pie. Name a bird that walks funny. Uh, an ostrich. Tell me a woman's name that starts with the letter M. Maria. Name a food people eat a lot of during the holidays. Uh, turkey. <laughs> All right, good job. Let's see how you did. A sport that requires a lot of running, you said football. 
survey said. <laughs> Absolutely. Something that can be cherry flavored. You said. <laughs> pie. Yeah, I guess that would be fake cherries. <laughs> cherry flavored. Survey said. Six. There you go. A bird that walks funny. You said. The ostrich. Yes. Survey said. 14. A woman's name that starts with the letter M. You said. Maria. Ave. Survey said. Oh. How can that be? A food that people eat a lot of during the holidays. You said. Turkey. Survey said. Clear the board. Bring out David. All right, David. She got you 89 points. You need 111. I'll ask you the same five questions. You can't duplicate the answers. If you do, you'll hear this sound. Uh -huh. Try again. Right. It's tougher, so we're going to give you 25 seconds. Are you ready? Yeah. Remind everyone of Joanna's answers. 25 seconds on the clock. Time will start after I read the first question. Name a sport that requires a lot of running. Soccer. Name something that can be cherry flavored. Ice cream. Name a bird that walks funny. Ostrich. Try again. Uh, flamingo. Tell me a woman's name that starts with the letter M. Mary. A food people eat a lot of during the holidays. Turkey. Try again. Stuffing. Okay. All right. 111 points we need. A sport that requires a lot of running, you said soccer, which can also be called football. Survey said <laughs> number one answer, 86 points you need. Something that can be cherry flavored, you said ice cream. That's right. Survey said 11. <laughs> Soda. Soda, number one answer. A bird that walks funny, you said a flamingo. Survey said 16. <laughs> Penguin. Penguin, number one answer. A woman's name that starts with the letter M. You said Mary. I can't believe Marie only got two. Survey said <laughs> Mary was the number one answer. 27 points you need. A food that people eat a lot of during the holidays. You said Stuffing. It goes in the turkey and they eat a lot of turkey. <laughs> Survey said. Oh. Turkey was the number one answer. I don't know what number two was, but $5 a point, $865, and they are being brought back tomorrow to fight off another family for another shot at $20,000 right here on the Family Feud. Come on back. You don't want to miss it. Hi, I'm Donald Faison, host of the crazy new game show, Insanity. And I know how much you like to play along at home. Well, now you really can. Use your smartphone, your tablet, your laptop. Best of all, you have the chance to win, too. Go to InsanityLive.com, register, and play along in real time with Winsanity. Yeah! And if a contestant wins a prize, you could win that prize, too. It's like being on the show, except you're in your PJs in your living room. Winsanity, all new Thursday, 9, 8 central, only on GS.